X gone give it to ya, you gone give it to you, X gone give it to ya, you go Oh no, what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh god. Break here now. What's going on guys? It's myself, Blinded Dubs, aka Plays, and welcome back to episode number seven of Resident Evil Code Veronica, where we're gonna take off the horrorous invention of Rockfort Island. So we just in the uh, Ashford complex known as the private residence and we're gonna head off with the red king and and place it on top of the music box for sure anyway guys but I'm just gonna go in the storage box and get out what we actually need to get but for sure I just need a grenade um, set of rounds out but I'm just gonna go for the fire and just the normal and that's about it that would just do for the job absolutely fine but i'm not going to take the rest up because i'll just want to save for some for later on in the game for sure guys so smash that subscribe and hit that notification bell if you're new to the channel because this is mainly based on gaming let's plays and obviously tech stuff as well but not only that, I also have a separate channel for all my music tracks, which I'm currently focusing on, guys. So be sure to check it out. So I will put it in the description, of course. But then again, let's head off to the palace right now, then. But I've got the bow gun equipped, but I'm just going to equip the grenade launcher. It looks more like a shotgun, but yeah. We'll go and kick some ass with it, dudes. People. Yeah, we'll go through this door. And then we'll go on the other side. But I can fit. Oh, what the hell? Where did these guys just bloody spring from? Right. Go and bust into cornflakes, you muppets. Okay. Right, come on. Come on. Come on. Right, cornflakes time. Come on. Button it, will ya? Stop making that moaning noise, please, Mr. Zombies. I do not need your assistance. Yelling away, please. I just about had enough of you guys, so stop giving me all that moan, will ya? Right, we're gonna get up these stairs. And while these guys have stopped the moaning after we just uh, blasted them into cornflakes, we're gonna progress through up the stairs. Okay. What the freaking hell is just going on? I'm just gonna combine these because I just heard something just like some stretch arm strong freaking jerks out there. And what is he doing? Oh, get off, get off, get off, get off. Stop grabbing my head, you damn fool. Damn foolish creatures, hey? Okay. Have they just gone down? Right. That's just done. But it might contain a bit of some name calling language or anything because I just hate these freaking jerks, I should say. But oh god, the, the palace, of course. Okay. Right, I'm just gonna right climb up this way. No. Up these stairs will actually help, but I'm just gonna go through these. I can't go through the door because it's broken. So no chance we're going to progress through, but yes, this is the only way we can go. I just don't like the look of this, but it looks like some posh property though. Well, I wouldn't buy it if I was given a mortgage, of course though. What the hell is that? Right, this is the only thing I got is that. Really, and that's about it. I was hoping to save some for the big boys. Okay, no, it's the other room. We've got to go then, and that's where we need to head to, because not only that, we've placed the blue ant in there, but we've just got to place the red ant in the other room. Right, bust into cornflakes. Mind you, it's one of my favourite cereals so far. I love having that for breakfast, of course, and then some slices of toast, yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. 
I'm looking forward to do some Resident Evil music remixes and turn them into club bangers, of course, for sure. So I'm aiming to do this this year. As um, Thingamajig has hardly got any, I just need to go in there. No, I don't want to use a first aid spray to put in the slot. Oh, that's unlocked for sure. But yes, we'll take the music box plate. Well, it's open, and then we're going to place it in the other one. Because when the music box goes, then something just actually happens. A secret passage is revealed. Oh, yes, we do know that. Right, a common picture, that's all I've known. Okay, so... We'll go back in this room. The music box lid is open, so we place the music box plate in there. So that's open now, we can uh, climb up these uh, steps and see what's on the other side, on, on the upper floor. Okay. I'm not too keen on this, guys. Really not too keen on this. Something's got to pop on the other side. Oh, crikey. Okay. A picture of an ant is drawn on the wall. It appears that the keyhole is the mouth part. My god, I've not even heard this music for so long, man. Oh, okay. That's a herb there. Right. The silver dragonfly. Please don't come back to life. Oh, yes, yeah, so this is a music room then. Right, there's just got to be a way of, um, like, getting around this. So the only thing we can do is just examine this dragonfly, so it will just help if we just check it. A dragonfly wings has been attached. Right, there's a button on there. Well, what I'm only thinking of is um, this might even have to go in there. I wonder if this would work. Let me just give it a try. Right, it starts the merry-go-round. Okay. So now we can progress on the upper floor now. So this is where Alexia has all her fun, hey? I even call it Alexa. I'm referring to the Amazon Alexa. Referring, not referring. <laughs> I'm getting my words wrong now. <laughs> okay. Up we go. What is this now? Don't tell me it's a storage box. Oh, it's a crate. Oh no. Okay, you could save your progress with this. Okay, cool, cool. We done it. Where are you supposed to move this block to? Okay, so we're only supposed to move it till we, because there's something up there, look, it appears to look like a book. So there must be something that's inside this book, of course. 
Right, let me just get Claire on this side and let's push this over there, shall we? Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it, Claire. Whack it straight in. Oh, yes. Okay. Right, looks like a green book and we'll take it. A confession letter. Alexia, my sister is generous and possesses unmatched beauty. She's everything to me. I would overcome my obstacle and be willing to risk my life for her. For Alexia, I must revive the glorious Ashford family which fell during the era of my fighter. Fighter! Alexandra! Together, we will restore our family name. Once that has been achieved, I'll build a palace where my nobles may gather. I cannot allow the unwashed to see my dear Alexia, to whom my life has devoted to. She re she reigns the world as the queen, and I as her servant. This is my dream, and how sweet would it be? Those accomplishments will be the proof of my love towards Alexia. It is the purpose of my existence. And... Other people in a meaningless, they shall soon prostrate themselves before Alexia and I, devoted by my love, Alexia. It's myself, Alfred Ashford. Let's make a sweet exit from this note. And what's underneath there? Right, okay. Looks like we got the free plates to make our escape routes then. Um, that's about it. I don't think anything is in here that we need so far. Right, so there's just a whole load of chemistry books. Okay, we're going to climb down the ladder. But I believe we could make us escape for the heli... Oh, well, for the air... The aircraft hangar. That's what I was meant to say. I don't think there's anything else that we need from here. I can imagine what the palace would look like back then anyway. But yeah. Right, let's just look in these drawers, shall we? There's nothing useful. Okay. Like, that's a piano. One of my favourite tools for when I'm producing music. So I love having my piano keyboards. <laughs> Okay, so just need to put this on. We're fine at that. Of oh, yes. We're just going to take the trip back to the roundabout and then we're going to climb down where we need to climb. So we've gone back into the bedrooms. Oh, oh no. Okay, we're in the right place. There we go. Claire Redfield, hold it oh right my there. god. We meet each other at last. A pity I must say goodbye so soon. I am Alexia Ashford. For the pride of the Ashford family, I will kill you. Ouch. Uh. Wait. What's going on? Okay. okay. I'm fine. It's just a scratch. <laughs> Scratching as in DJ. <laughs> oh, what's happened to Steve? Okay, Steve seems to be uneasy. I better check this room. Okay. Oh no, something's just happened in here. This must be. Look who it is. It's Alfred Ashford. I knew it was him hiding up there. Okay, what's he doing? Oh yes. Oh yes, you're getting what's coming to you, mate. You're getting what's coming to you. Come on then, bring it on, big man. Wait a second. 
What just happened? Yeah, so he looked there up. never was an Alexia after all. You mean he thinks he's two people? Okay, that's it. Let's get out of here. The self-destruct system has that been That freak! Activated. He's trying to blow us up along all with the entire facility. Come on, we gotta get to that airport. Right. Right, okay, let's go to the airport now. Wow. I never knew you could actually go through this way. It was a secret door, of course. So we're going to exit the complex now and we're going to get to the aircraft hangar. But now we've got all these three plates, the red... Well, I'm going to call them the RGB plates because it's red, green and blue. Okay. Yeah, so thank you guys for the support. Much appreciated. Oh, yes. Okay. Right, down we go, down we go. There we go, Claire. Right. What do you think of Resident Evil Code Veronica? It's one of my favourites so far. And I just love doing series based on this. Okay. Yes, down we go, down we go. Oh, we can't even go this way because the wall's been battered up. The amount of times I've just been this way is just unbelievable. I just don't like how he's just vomits down up there. Yes, the self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Please proceed to the bottom platform. Please proceed to the bottom platform. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel must evacuate immediately. Releasing all locks. Oh yes. Self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel must evacuate immediately. Releasing all locks. Okay. Let's get these plates out. That's one. Where's the green plate? We better equip these just in case anything happens. No, but we know where we have to go. We have to start up the aircraft. But by the time we try to escape, the thing is we come to the stage where we do need to raise the bridge up. Okay. Up! Oh, there we go! There we go! That's it! Claire! Those are the spiders! We'd better get out of here too! Right! Let's go! Yes, all personnel must evacuate immediately. The South Destruct system has to be back. Come on, Steve, get on with it. Damn fool. Oh, yes, I'm glad I've got this far. Yeah, fancy doing freaking sub for sub, which I actually hate because I'm actually travelling in a submarine right now, eating a subway sandwich, of course. Mmm, made me so full right now. Yes, we're going to evacuate immediately, so stop spamming us with that because you're making me hungry once again. Steve, where are you going? Where are you going? He's gonna left me behind. We've gone to the bottom of the ocean now. Well, our secret territory. Right, bust into cornflakes, you mop it. No, you get away from me now. Looks like that's some bio experiment there. 
Oh, okay. Possibly a control for the system of the airport. What, it stopped in mid-air, but how do we even enable it? Okay, so we got what we need then. Push the switch. No, it won't work. Something seems to be missing, so we need to insert these plates in there. That's one, and then we've got to get the second one in. And the third one just goes in right in the middle. Apparently the control panel from the lift. Well. Oh, okay. So we're in our little aircraft now. Unless we raise the bridge. Leave that to me. You stay here and make preparations for takeoff. Yes, Roger that. Well, I didn't know Steve had a pilot's license though. Okay, somehow we just got to raise that bridge, so we've got to go back the other way. Oh my god. These freaking jerks don't even know when to give up. Yes, whatever. Would you please stop spamming that on the tannoy, please? I don't even need it. Yes, we know that. We just want to get in our plane and just get the hell out of here. Okay, looks like... We can't go through that door. That's our bit when we play as Chris Redfield. Okay. Right, a control panel for the bridge. Looks like we got to insert this. Right. How do we even get across? Well, we need to get back the other way now. I'm not looking forward to this now. Okay. This device controls bridge oil pressure. Okay. Looks like we can't do anything to it. Oh, what's this down there? It's an airport key. We need to take it. That's it. We've got what we needed then. We just need to examine the key and just check what the number on it. It's a K402 key, so we can actually go in there and do what we need to do. And Release that shutter. I thought you could actually go in there as Chris Redfield, but I was absolutely wrong, for sure. But yeah, there we go. We've got that, and then we couldn't go this way. All oh, right, woman, please shut up. Stop saying that, or else you're gonna make the place blow. That will actually do.
Okay, so we've unlocked this shutter now. We can go through this door. I'm not looking forward to this now. Okay. Oh, we finally got some ammo now. We just need to get these this ammo and then we can unjam the lift. Let's just mix it up, mix it up and do our set. Just mix it up on the deck, shall we? Okay, let's just combine these and then we are done. And then we're ready to whack it straight in with Claire. I can't even go this way. Somehow we've just got to move these. I don't know who's actually left the crates right in the doorway, but it was a stupid idea. Right, finally got the door unjammed. Okay, whatever. We've only got five minutes left, guys. Okay. I will not allow you fools to escape. This is what you get for trying to oppose me. Now feel my revenge. <laughs> So she is uh, two people in one. Look who's come out. It's Mr. Frickin' X. X gon' give it to ya. You gon' give it to you. X gon' give it to ya. You gon' give it to ya. Do you wanna fold? Do you wanna ruck? Do you wanna fight? Don't let it go. X gon' give it to ya. You gon' give it to you. X gon' give it to ya. Mr. Tyrant. Oh, pig off. Okay. What the hell? Can I even run past him? What the freaking hell, man? Okay, I'll just need to combine these and then we can actually bust this freaking guy into cornflakes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Big man, big man, big man. Right, come on, bring it on. Well, I think you're clever enough, ain't it? Okay. Right, I think you could come closer, but nothing is happening. So if you try and harass me, but then again, you ain't gonna get jack all off me. Okay, come on. Okay, let's just combine these lot then and see if we can get anywhere with this bloody thing though. Now, I don't want to unequip, but I just want to just like get this Mr. X out of the way. Thank you. See you later, mate. No, I don't want to step into the fire. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay, so let's go into the cockpit now. So we're just going to head back over to the 
airplane and take off from there, shall we? Yeah, yeah, I know. I really appreciate all of you just watching my crazy Let's Plays, though, but still. Ah, shut it, mate. Well, I'm just going to equip this for now. I don't want to waste any too much of my heavy-duty ammunition. So we just heading back into the sub and then we're going to go into our secret escape route that will take us to the other side. Well, we just move the lever and get to the bottom of the sea floor then. Well, that's that one done. Okay, come on, Claire, let's just get up this. I was meant to say yes, not no. If I've been a little bit quiet in this series, it's because uh, this is such a great game. Oh god, here we go. I hate these freaking jerks. I think we're there now. Right, get in there, Claire. What took you so long? I was starting to get worried. No time to explain. Let's go. Right, we're out of here. Time to say goodbye to this death trap. Okay. They think they've ended the game, but obviously they've not. I didn't know Steve can actually fly. Okay. This ain't the end of the game, guys. There is... We made it! Yahoo! Oh, yes. Uh, it's finally over. Not yet. Not yet, Claire. If you say so. I think Steve and Claire have got a crush on each other. Claire... I'm sorry. I know I caused a lot of trouble for you. No, it's okay. It was hard for both of us. All right. Yeah. Okay. I really hope you find your brother. I I know what it's like to be alone. Oh, Steve. <clears throat> so, where should we go now? I can take you anywhere you want to go, Claire. <laughs> I hear Hawaii's nice this time of year. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay, so they're going to Hawaii. Alright. What is he actually doing? Oh, there's Alexia. Okay. The two in one. So he's tried to make his escape. This game is not over yet. Well, now I think it is. What real terror is all about. Aha! Uh -huh. They're gonna try and stalk us now as we were just going on our honeymoon. Hey! 
cargo room hatch is open. I'll go back and check it out. Thanks. I've unlocked the cargo room door. Okay, so we're gonna initiate another boss fight. I believe it's that freaking Mr. X has come on board now. I actually call I've got in the habit of calling him Mr. X, but he's actually uh, Tyrant. I'm not looking forward to this. That's got to be twice in a row I had to, like, fight him off. So, Steve sent me out to go and check him out. Okay. Go and see what's going on on the cargo today. Frick. It's that freaking pig squeak again. What does he want now? How did he even just get on board? God, he's mutating now. Materials preparation complete. Catapult ready. Okay. Oh no, what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh god. Break here now. Ouch. That's gonna take a lot out of you, eh? Oh god. Oh! Break here now. Just need to get some health now. Oh, what the bloody hell. This is the catapult launching device. The launch has been prepared. Oh god, no. Oh my god, no! Oh, come on. Come on. Right, there we go. Oh dear. We're crying out loud. Okay, what the hell? Nah, he takes a lot out of you. Okay. We just have to deal with what we got. That's done it straight away. Wow. Didn't think we're gonna get rid of him just like that. But we can just get back over to the control room or the cockpit, whatever you just call it though. What was wrong? Oh nothing. Just a giant cockroach that had to be stepped on. Yeah, lie. What's happening? I don't know. The plane just changed direction on its own. It's flying in autopilot mode. I can't switch over to manual control. My yeah. apologies. But I cannot let you escape now. <laughs> Alfred, cross-dressing freak. Yep, I knew it was who was controlling the plane. My god, this is where it gets a little bit emotional. It's when Steve and Claire fancy each other, but... It's only a video game, guys. Wow.
just got to enjoy the cinematics on this, to be fair. Okay, enough is enough. Snap out of it, you two, will ya? What is this place? Hey, where are we? Huh? Latitude, 82.17 degrees. What the freak? That's the Antarctic. We're over the Antarctic. What? Those are the seaplanes that left the island right before us. Then that must mean this place belongs to Umbrella. Yep, I know something was to do with Umbrella. This has got to be Umbrella's hidden complex that we don't even know of. Well, that was the only way we can actually escape the aircraft, but that was about it. Uh oh, my god, this is a, li a little bit rude, but I don't want to say too much about it though. Thanks. trashed. Well, let's split up and find another way off this oversized freezer. Right. Okay, let's do it. Okay, I like how he just describes it as oversized freezer. It is an oversized freezer, I'm sure, of course, for sure, anyway. But, okay, we just, can we even go this way? Emergency evacuation storage restricted area. But we can't go this way though, but I'm just gonna go the other way. Come on, this is the only way we can actually go down. But I don't even know which doors are we supposed to go through, but we need to save what we need to save. I believe this is the save room here. No, it's more like a dormitory. Well, we got some bowgun arrows. Oh, freaking hell. What the hell? Oh, come on. Come on, you freaking jokes. Get on with it, will ya? You ain't coming near me. You ain't coming near me. Get down there. That's it. No, I don't believe this. Oh, come on. Can we even combine these? It'll be much better if we do. Oh, more ammo. That will just do it fine. Let's just combine these. That's done. Oh, 
the map of the base, we've taken that. Right, bust this one into cornflakes and this one. See you later. Oh, more goodies. We've taken them. That's that done. So we've done combining these. I think this is going to be the longest episode of the entire series then. We'll go and see what's on the other side. Okay, um, before we even go in there, let's just go downstairs and see what's in the other room. But those were the dormitory. But managed to get jump scared by these freaking zombie freaks. A monster might have been the killer. Right, this might be the right place here. But I'm just going to actually end this episode. But thank you all guys for watching. Only useless box are here. It seems something was dragged down here. It's locked. No keyhole can be found. But the only keyhole there is, is where the axe goes. Right. Just got to say thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you all later. And take care of yourselves. Peace out.